Good afternoon, welcome to Wendy Hill Kennel. I'm Kathy Grandstaff and we are located in Utica, Ohio. We specialize in schnoodles and schnauzers. Today we're downstairs on the patio finally on a nice day and we're down here with Laramie's kids. Uh, they're not sure where they're at but this is the first time they've been outdoors and they're doing super super good. Um, everybody's doing well. Mom's a great mom with them and uh, so I don't suspect there's going to be any issues with anybody the way they're going. They're doing great. So we're going to go through, we're going to give you microchip numbers. Uh, I can give you an estimated eye color at this point, especially with this light out here. And um, so we're going to start with this one. This one is the yin yang. And this is a female. And I'm pretty sure she has one blue and one dark. I don't think this has got blue in it. So this eye on this side is absolutely blue. This one I think is a normal color dark eye. So as of right now, it looks like she's got one blue and one normal dark eye. 2177 is her microchip number. Let me have one more peek at your face. Yeah, I think it's dark, but she does have a blue one on this side. She's got really pretty coat. They're nice and fat and chunky, super thick. See, just a really pretty blue merle. Can you sit there and look at Brittany and hold still for one sec? See, maybe. All right, let's see what you weigh. You're a chunk. I bet you're over three pounds. Close. She's two pounds, 14 ounces. She's really close to that three pound mark. All right, so I should have brought collars down there. Old enough to do them. I'll do them next week. So this is the other blue merle. We're going to go through these and before I lose who I've done, lose track. This one is a male, 2176. He's the one with one black paw and one blue merle paw and one black ear on that same side as the foot and a blue merle ear on that side. Really pretty coloring. They have really nice colors, huh? And this one also is a male. All right, so let's see what you weigh today. Oh, there comes a spider. Get out of here. Got it. Two pounds, seven ounces. All right, Munchkin. It's on your backside. Okay. This is the last Merlin here. Oh, you know what? I didn't tell you eye color. Got fixated on the spider and didn't give you eye color. Both dark. Ah, uh, maybe not. Okay, look at me, not the sun. There you go. This eye on this side has definitely got blue in it. It's not a like total blue. And I think they both have a little blue, but they're not all blue, but this one definitely has blue in it. Okay, put you down. Let me get you, my dear. This is a female, microchip 2183. She's got a black ear and with a little bit of blue on this side and almost an all black on this side. And I think I got a look at your eyes when you were moving. I wanna tell you they're both double blue, but she's blinking because of the light. You can, can I get you not to look at the light? I know what I see you staring at me. I can't tell. I think this one has blue and I think this one does too, but I don't want to tell you they're a double blue. So next week we should know for sure. So let's see what you weigh. It's tough out here in this light. It's much better in the light in the house. Two pounds, 6.5. Okay, Munchkin. I'm gonna hold up and let Brittany get a picture of your face. Okay, this one is a party. This one is not going to stay the color you see. This one is 2179. This looks black, but it's not. Underneath of here, it's brown. It's got a, there's a grayish color in there. You can also really see it on the back of her ears. So her spots are going to turn probably buff. You can see them under there to a salt and pepper. See, it's tough to tell, huh? 
me see your eyes. She has both normal dark eyes. This is Microchip 2179. Who's back there? Are you choking on something you got back there? No, you're just coughing. There, you got it up. Two pounds, 4.5 is what she weighs today. We'll set you out here. One more week, we gotta put the pants up. I'm, I'm gonna tell you that for sure. This is a really pretty black and white, 2180. It's got really nice coloring. She's got, it's a he. Yep, it's a boy. And really pretty face, a little bit of a white mustache. It's also getting, back, see the black in the feet? It's got black on each toe. So it's gonna have a little bit of spotting in the coat. I don't know if you'll have any up here. Nope, but the toes are all turning black underneath there. That's cool, he's gonna have spots on each toe. All right, and you weigh one pound 15.8. All right, so the last one in here is the one that has raised a lot of interest, but unfortunately she is sold. And so the lady that bought this puppy, if you will please give me a call or shoot me a text because I lost your link to your phone number and your name on my phone and you have not sent the contract in yet. So I know your deposit's in, but I need you to give me a call. So this puppy is sold. She's a really pretty Wheaton and White got really really nice coat and she's getting a new spot under here too got a spot showing under there I know it really pretty coat oh I know I got you I got you you're okay I like her blaze she's got even markings on both eyes and she's got the dot in the top of her head and she's got a brown nose I know and I think I think they're blue, I can't tell. But we noticed in the house that they were, didn't look black, so I'm wondering if they're gonna be blue. Two pounds, six ounces altogether. So, please give me a call so I can put your name on that puppy. <laughs> I've never done that and lost the whole link, but I did this time. So I hope you have uh, enjoyed their video. Uh, they're doing great, they're getting really nice and big. And, She's done a great job with this litter. So, check your eye. I keep, they're either gonna be green or they're gonna be blue because she's a, she has got a brown nose. But I can't tell you which at this point. So, I hope you guys have a great Memorial Day weekend. I hope you are have a safe one. And if you have any questions on these guys at all, you're more than welcome to give me a call. And this is probably the quietest they're ever gonna be after this, they just get more active and more active so have a great weekend and uh, stay safe